You know, nobody wants to go to the doctor because they've been having problems with memory or forgetfulness or reasoning or judgment or any of those symptoms of dementia, possibly because they're afraid. They're afraid of what they're going to hear. But early diagnosis can be so empowering. For one, it gives people a sense of relief because it gives them answers. And it really validates the experience and the challenges that both the person with dementia has been experiencing as well as the care partner. Once you have that diagnosis, you begin to open up opportunities for clarity. You can learn a lot about the disease and it opens up resources like support groups, educational programs, and ways to really think about building a life of resilience and wellness. I think early diagnosis is one of the most important things that we can do to instill the opportunity for living alongside these difficult diseases in the most optimal way possible. It's not just early diagnosis for the sake of getting your affairs in order or legal and financial planning or end of life planning. I mean, all of that is important. In fact, it's important for us even if we don't have a, a diagnosis of an illness like Alzheimer's disease. But I think what's more important is to understand what's been causing a lot of the distress and angst in our life. Families can come together around a diagnosis and be proactive in preparing a better future for themselves.